I am Ingrid Maadvere and I work as an educational technologist at Gustav Adolf Grammar School. Educational technologist, what does it mean? What do I do? It is a very interesting profession and it means that I work with teachers and technology. And if you think about a school, a modern school, you can find lots of lots of interesting things like cameras, robots, virtual reality, computers, iPad, etc. And then, of course, sometimes you can find an IT guy who is installing everything, putting it into order. But it doesn't work like that. The teachers need more. They need somebody who knows how to use technology in the learning process. So I'm a little bit mix of uh, a teacher and an IT guy. I love my job and uh, I love teaching. Uh, so uh, I started as an elementary school teacher and then when our IT guy left, I started to work as an educational technologist. When we talk about the history of educational technologies, then the first educational technologies started to work in uh, 2000 and it was the University of Tartu. Uh, I started to work in 2007. I was the first educational technologist in the basic school. We also have an as association of educational technologists and it means it's like a network of educational technologists. We share our ideas. If I have a question, I can ask very quickly. Uh, we have hotlines like Skype and uh, every educational technologist is different in a way. Uh, in some schools there are educational technologists and in some schools we don't have educational technologists. In these schools usually teachers do these tasks or IT managers. What do I do? For example today I came from school, I had three workshops with teachers, we talked about the development of digital literacy and it means that in my school we don't have IT lessons, everything is integrated into the curriculum. We discuss our curriculum. Is it okay to teach Excel in this level? Is it okay to do a presentation in English lesson? And uh, one teacher asked me about a tool that uh, she wanted to create a word cloud to examine some essay words and we started to find a new solution for that. So this is one task that I work with teachers, I try to find tools and the digital literacy, also teachers and students, we work with that. But also the development is very important. It means that we, uh, we try to find new ways to use technology. If you think about the corona time or all these new approaches in the pedagogy, they all need technology. And then I have to answer the questions. There are so many questions and no answers. So we start to test, we start to find new ways and we start to invent something. Uh, I love it a lot. And I think that this is the job of an educational technologist. Thank you.